Hey, what's going on guys? It's Street Crypto here back for another video. In today's video, I want to talk about the Wink token uh, and its ticker of WIN and give you guys a price prediction for the short and long term. So WIN's currently sitting at just about 0.1 of a cent or exactly right now it's at 0.09 of a cent. There's a lot of, a lot of zeros here just to note. Uh, and its circulating supply is currently sitting at 766 billion with a market cap of nearly the same in terms of million with 766 million in market cap. If we have a look at all time charts, we can see that Win has an all time high uh, near 0.25 of a cent. Uh, now that was reached in its earlier run uh, towards March and April. And then we saw a low of, uh, I'm not even going to say had that many zeros, but just, just that number. And then uh, we've been regressing ever since. But if you don't know what Wink is, essentially uh, the first Tron ecosystem comprehensive oracle, Wink Link fully integrates the real world with the blockchain space and will be able to provide reliable, unpredictable, and verifiable random numbers and fully restore trust and improve user experience user experience by tapping into data events and payment systems from the real world. So essentially Wink is a part of the Tron ecosystem and it is a Oracle and uh, Wink has its own industry in the gaming sector. So Wink acts as a token for the, their website and their system called, uh, you know, wink.org. And this essentially is a gambling website. As you can see here, there's a bunch of different games. I'm sure you guys have seen gambling before. Uh, so it's essentially, you put your money into this website and you don't get anything back. That's essentially how gambling works. Uh, now I know buying shit coins is another form of gambling, but I don't really agree with um, just gambling in, in essence, but I just want to talk about the Wink token and where I think it can go. Some important things to note, it is on Binance, it's on major exchanges, and that's really going to add to volume and potential for a pump. It is also part of the Tron ecosystem, so Wink isn't going to just die instantly because it's part of a really, really big ecosystem, and it would be a really huge issue if something were to happen in terms of uh, you know, a rug pull or some suspicious activity, there would be a lot of questions asked. But Wink is currently in this in the gambling sector, and the gambling sector hit a record of 43.6 billion in 2019 in terms of revenue. And I imagine this number is just going to keep growing as people want to make quick money. Uh, little do they realize if they follow my YouTube channel, then they'll make money twice as fast. Uh, but Today, I'm just going to talk about just price action for Wink. I don't have many stories. I just want to talk about where I think it's going in terms of the token. If we look at the four hour, we can see uh, this kind of trend line formed. It's actually something more like this. Uh, now, we've got obviously got a massive move here in the last day or so. Uh, now, if you look here, it was a move of nearly 55% in around about uh, one day, which is really, really big for crypto even. Uh, the thing I wanna note is it's looking very slim, similar to uh, what we saw here. Now, this was a move of similar propulsions going around about oh, a little bit higher, nearly 70% in about a day or so. And then we saw a massive pullback. But the thing I wanna note is this sort of triangle that we formed. Now, I'm noticing the similarities here um, mainly because of the volume. Look, if we have a look here, volume in terms of green was actually higher until we saw a massive red volume, which could be starting to form on the four hour here, depending about where this candle closes. Uh, so it's just gonna be interesting to see what happens in the next couple of hours. Now, if we do get a similar move, uh, like we saw just at the start of November, uh, we could see Wink uh, regressing all the way back down to near enough the trend line. Now that would see us test at least support at around about uh, eight. I'm going to say eight uh, because that's 0 0.08 of a cent. Uh, now, where I would be setting to look if you're setting to if you're wanting to set buy orders for Wink uh, is around this level. Uh, now, the reason I say that is because it would be a similar drop to the uh, last move we made and it would see us form new support uh, at previous resistance at 0.8. Uh, but if it was to break down of this triangle even further, it looks like the next support is around about 0.7. Uh, now, just things to note with Wink that Wink is trading uh, near all time highs in terms of the last couple of months. It, uh, its overhead all time high is uh, quite a way away. Uh, it's around about 200% from where we are now. So there is still a massive potential in terms of 
uh, previous all-time highs. But the thing you have to note is if a crypto has pumped 50% in one day, it is usually a pretty fucking bad idea to buy it. So just be a little bit careful uh, buying at these inflated levels right now. If you're wanting to come into Wink, I uh, would wait for something in this resistance zone at least. Now that would see uh, somewhere between uh, 0.7 and 0.6 as I mentioned before. So if you're looking to buy, just look for look for at least a wick or set orders in this zone. Just don't 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 be the guy that buys up here and then cries about it when uh, we see a correction because obviously a 50% move is going to ask for a correction in the future. But that was just a quick video on Wink. If you guys want to check out any other cryptos, let me know down below. But I'll see you guys in the next one and peace.